What's good, GH? We drinking water. We trying to stay hydrated. What's up, Mel? I'm chilling, man. The human dog? Mm-hmm. Mm-mm. Oh, the human robot? Yeah. Yo, that's a restaurant, right? Down the street. Yeah. It's a bar. I peeped it. That was a commercial, too, Mel. It definitely was, yo. We, yeah, they got a human robot. Y'all got to cut us a check. Yeah, we're going we gonna to make sure. <laughs> mm-hmm. But, yeah, big week in the fights, man. Yeah, Canelo yeah. Alvarez, you named his decision against Edgar Belenga. You yeah. dropped him in the third. Yeah. What's your thoughts? Um, before the fight, I, I had Berlinga get stopped fifth or sixth round. Um, so I, again, I take my hat off to Berlinga. He stays sturdy. Um, the best thing about the fight was Berlinga didn't. He didn't act like Jamel Charlo act. Like he didn't just let Canelo run down. You know what I'm saying? They had they, they even had a few exchanges where it was on some after the bell type shit or mm-hmm. on the break type shit. It was a fight. He socked the shit out Canelo one time. Canelo tried Canelo to, walk, tried to off. walk off on him. Yeah, he, he tried to walk off because he heard the bell and Canelo took it like it was the you know the final bell, but it was the um, ten second bell. And um, Berlinga socked the shot with a hook. Um, it was a, that that made it action packed. Uh, the fact that they was going back and forth, Canelo punched him on the legs a couple times. It, it was a gritty jump. Um, I felt like Berlinga was letting his hands go, but wasn't in full confidence. He was letting his hands go, kind of just to say, like, "All right, motherfucker, I'm here. Like, don't, don't keep getting crazy." Um, Canelo was trying his best to get him out. I mean, he even had some rounds where it looked like he almost got him, especially when he started going to the body real good. Especially when he started going to the body real good. Um, I mean, the jab for Canelo was beautiful. I think Berlinga's jab was pretty good, too. I felt like Berlinga, yeah, we could always say, yeah, he could have did more. But he did better than what a lot of people think. I mean, nobody really nobody really thought Berlinga was going not just hang around, but, you know, make it that type of fight. And here's the thing. Berlinga... If Berlanga can keep that mindset that he had for Canelo, if he can keep that moving forward, he's going to be very dangerous at 168 pounds, for sure. I thought it was an exciting fight. Even though a lot of people was like, I ain't buying that shit, I ain't watching that shit, this, this, and that. It was worth watching, man. It was a, it was a beautiful fight, and it was a beautiful card. Where does Canelo go from there? Canelo Alvarez, again, he's the cream of the crop. You saw that when Berlinga raised his hands, people started booing. Canelo raised one hand, and the crowd went nuts. He got the people right now. Like it or not. I don't care how many people be like, oh, he be cherry picking and this and that. Guess what, man? He he earned the right to do that. Because when you could bring 20,000 people out, 20 plus thousand people out, and, you know, really put on a show, hey, man, you could do that type of shit. So, really, I don't know what's next. And I don't really care to see what's next, but... You know, whoever it is gonna hit the lottery. Gonna we'll make some money. I say it maybe be Christian and Billy mm-hmm. or Diego Pacheco. I think it's too early for Pacheco. I think and Billy will be a good one. I think and Billy because him coming from that camp, he come from the Mark Ramsey camp. Um, they breed killers. I mean, every time you see Mark Ramsey with a guy, most of the time they knockout artists. So it'll be good to see, but Canelo just. He has a presence that makes you that makes you kind of it make it, make, it, it kind of make you like not believe in yourself. Like believe in yourself, of course you believe in yourself because you're getting in there with him. But it's like I ain't about to go in here and start trying all this shit because Canelo ain't knocking me out. That'd be like the mindset. If if and Billy could go in there and say fuck it and just rumbling, might get a different story. You never know, but. That right now I see is the issue with Canelo. People respect Canelo on a whole different type of level. Berlinga barely threw punches the first round because he just wanted to see what it was hitting for. You know what I'm saying? So, I, I, you know what I mean? I really don't know. But Pacheco, too early for Pacheco. I don't think Pacheco should take that fight. He a big kid, though. Dangerous. He is dangerous, but I don't think, think it would be right for him.